has helped us out with commentary so many times. Uh, probably would have helped out tonight if I had asked, but I was like, this man has a baby. This mm -hmm. man's just competing. Like, I, I want to give him a bit of a break. Right. You know? Has made, um, you know, top four three weeks in a row commentating, playing, and be, and taking care of a human child. Like, yeah. It's, you know, you deserve, yeah. you deserve a week off. You can do, you can do just two of those things. We'll, we'll yeah, take let me the, scrape it. Yeah, we'll, we'll take a bit off yeah, that point. We'll, we'll take the easiest one away from you. <laughs> um, <laughs> but the, and we do have new childhood traditions up. Um, back yes. on and, and, and so here, this is our other side. The winner's top eight. So the winner basically is going to go um, up against Dysphoria for the winner's finals a little bit later. Um, yeah, Vagabond, you know, Vagabond, great showing last week. They won last week, right? Vagabond did? Mm -hmm. uh, yep, that was their yeah. second year. Yep, yeah, the, the week awesome. of the Crusaders. Good week. <laughs> yeah, yeah, quite the week. Holy, holy, holy. But, I'm, yeah. not, I'm not tired of them yet. I know a Crusader is very strong. Maybe at some point soon, maybe I'll be like, ah, oh, Crusader. Like, like, kind of like how some of us might be for Berserker. However, right now, this stuff is hype. Like, yeah. I, I'm just good to see. Oh, the armor, but again, the armor against armor. Yeah, Did not that. work out there well for Dave. That was so confident from that. They, they, they have been there before. Yeah. Oh, oh no again okay so danny phantom has gone for that twice now where you know he's expecting to armor through some of crusader's moves my question is what's what happens next like if if danny phantom armors through gets a hit and then uses conversion then he might be able to break vagabond's armor but if not it seems like vagabond just simply wins that interaction because that's what happened the last couple times Curious though, curious to see if we can see the interaction again, but this time with Game Pitch coming out on top and exactly how that kind of shakes out. <laughs> Dysphoria, your one losing matchup <laughs> to, uh, to DC, uh, talking about the character. Yeah, on, on PSN especially, as we all acknowledge that. Yo, dude, this is going to be essentially as much damage as Vanguard basically can get. Oh, without the drop! Oh, I'm so sorry. I should have said anything. He, he didn't go into super because he wanted to you know, confirm the next hit into guaranteed kill. Instead, tried to uh, extend the combo. Have a drop because of that. Oh, that would break the armor. Lots of conversion. I like to like have a song. Get out of there, don't go into sleepy tone mode. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that was fast enough to break through the uh, the attempt into Behead by Danny Phantom. That is one thing about Behead. You have to activate Brandish and then cancel it directly into Behead. Like, it's not an immediate DP. It's not an immediate armor move. It takes a couple of frames to get yourself into that armor. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh, good roll. A roll again, but goes directly into the low post from Vagabond. Oh, activates the armor. And gets his own armor broke, does Danny. Uh-oh, into Apocalypse combos. <laughs> this, this crap, this is what I love. So much. <gasps> no, dude. <laughs> he hit him with the holy, the whole. He hit him with the funny number, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it looked like one continuous combo. It was wild. It was absolutely insane. Oh. That was a 69 pick Crusader combo. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, baby, the throw out. Oh. There we go. Okay. I was just I was just saying, when are we gonna see the interaction work in favor of Danny? It finally did. He's gonna get great damage from this. Yep, does two rounds of the air uh, air MS move because he has the meter. Goes into brainage, but nothing coming out of it. Ooh. Okay, conversion is coming for sure to keep it safe. Yep. Okay, Danny's been a little more patient. He realizes this is his last leg, at least uh, on the winner's side of the bracket. He's gotta be careful. 
That's plus frames into the guard cancel. Okay. Oh, good option by Vagabond. That was something of a 50-50 right there. Like, Danny's call out to go for the 4S. Most buttons that Vagabond would have pressed, that would have worked. And he either would have, uh, you know, continued the the the, uh, the block pressure, getting closer and closer into guard break, or he would have got the win, right? Just with a uh, normal combo. But Vagabond jumps, does the spear Longinus, and uh, sends Danny Phantom into the loser's bracket.